guys it is Thursday January 14th 2016 uh, about 8 30 a.m. right now on my way to class my first class of the day my Thursdays aren't as bad as Tuesdays just because I don't have any night classes but um, I've got bio lab right now which I am on my way to so that is a fun way to start off my day but um, oh, it's freezing too. It, it's finally winter now it waited a long time, all the way up through the new year. It was like in the 40s, almost in the 50s. I think over break one day it was in the 60s, but it is consistently in the single digits now. So, um, freezing. But I had to head to class now and have some fun learning about meiosis. <laughs> Alright guys, so just got back from BioLab. And it's not a hard class. It is... Um, as you guys know, I've told you before, um, I am majoring and studying education. Um, so even though I won't use it, I explained that in a prior video. It's kind of a long story, so I'm not gonna explain it now, but um, I'm in education, so the biology class I'm taking is biology for elementary teachers. <laughs> and as you guys can probably assume, elementary teachers are predominantly female. And since it's a lab, it's a little bit smaller of a class. There's only 18 people in this lab. And there are 17 girls and then me. <laughs> so um, I, I told one of my friends about that. And he was like, well, guess you can strike out 16 times and you're still good. So um, yeah, I just thought that was interesting. So just got here to Target. Got to pick up a few things. And the reason I picked Target to come to tonight rather than like Walmart or something like that it's because I haven't bought a Blu-ray in like a week and a half, two weeks, and I'm having withdrawals. So, um, Target is my favorite place to get Blu-rays. I definitely think it's the cheapest, but um, going to run in here and see if they've got anything good. I think The Martian just came out, so we'll check it out. If I pick up The Martian and it comes with the digital copy code, you guys are getting it. So, let's head in here and see what they got. Alright, if you guys have been watching me for a while, then... You know I'm a big fan of The Walking Dead, of Fear of the Walking Dead. Season 1, $26.99. You couldn't pay me to add that to my collection. Hated it. Alright guys, so just got out of Target, picked up two movies. The first one is The Martian, and it does come with a digital copy code. So I will open this up for you guys real quick the other movie I got which is just a guilty pleasure movie that I love watching Tropic Thunder I mean the cast in this is awesome you got Ben Stiller Robert Downey Jr. Jack Black uh, Tom Cruise's cameo in that movie is hilarious um, that's just again like I said it's just a guilty pleasure movie of mine where I can just sit down and watch it any time but um, as I get this open um, the Martian, if you guys have seen my top 10 list of 2015, was in my top 5. I absolutely loved The Martian. I thought Matt Damon was, this might be my favorite Matt Damon movie. And the Bourne trilogy, which is about to be, he's about to be in another Bourne movie this year. Um, but the Bourne trilogy is fantastic, but I thought he was even better in this. But um, here is the digital copy code to the Martian so hopefully you guys can see that hopefully it's focused enough for you to see it that is the digital copy code to the Martian if you guys do get it make sure to comment down below let me know that you got it I uh, I love doing this stuff for you guys I love kind of giving back a little bit because I truly do appreciate you guys watching these videos but got to head back I might stop and get something to eat on my way back um, and uh, then head to the gym tonight. Oh, to let the meth out of King? Yeah, no problem. Go ahead, man. That's what happened. This guy came with the craziest thing. Uh, do you guys still have the chicken nuggets for $1.49? Uh, could I have the chicken nuggets with a value onion ring and then a regular Diet Coke, please? Five rep PR is like a five rep, like. Sometimes we forget. 
forget why we're here. It's easy to fall off track. These help us remember. These battle scars don't look like the fate. Don't look like the ever gone away. They ain't never gonna change. These battles. Growing up, I had a dream, something no one else could see. Tell me what it means when your faith is falling beneath your knees and you can't breathe. Everything you see reminds you of what you're not or something you won't be. You gotta take what you're given, that's how we live it. Don't be mad at the system, it's simply how we've existed. I hear a lot of people talking like they politicians and choose to be an accountant because it's safe in the business. Not because they wanna do it, just because they heard it pays. And who the fuck wants to be poor knowing that's how we've been raised? Society is getting heavy, I can feel the weight. The pressure of success is like a hundred million pounds of shame. And that's the reason I'm staying up late. Trying to find a way to escape the stereotypes This day and age is making me feel like the only way I'll be happy Is getting signed to a label and making money through rapping I wanna share my emotion because this world is attacking The very principle of life that lets the people be happy If you don't have a reason to breathe, why even live? These battles cause our impressions of everything that it is created equal because some decide to be great and some decide a sequel to an average person's life is simply what they want to be so you make your decision all i know is what i'm given on to find the life i lead or the way i dwell in existence i've seen a greater image on the walls of where i'm living and the words twisted and scripted remind me of something written faith is a gift that is given down to the people if one believes it one receives it it's given if it is needed don't ever think you're trapped in a life that you never wanted your options are infinite that's some mathematical logic i'm not saying I'm a prophet, I'm speaking for what it's worth These lyrics define my prayers and these battles cause I'm a church Not saying I'm a prophet, I'm speaking for what it's worth These lyrics define my prayers, these battles cause I'm a church guys so just got out of the theater went in there to see 13 hours the uh, Benghazi movie that Michael Bay just made and I didn't have too high of expectations going in sorry if you guys can't see me right now but I didn't have too high of expectations going in because it is a Michael Bay movie and I mean you basically know what you're gonna get with a Michael Bay movie these days he is so simplistic in his uh, directing but um, I mean I enjoyed it for the most part I guess uh, it wasn't great it wasn't terrible it was I don't know I feel like by the end of the year when I look back at all the movies that I watched in 2016 13 hours is gonna be one that is uh, very forgettable but it was cool to see um, uh, shoot I can't remember his name but the guy that played Jim in um, uh, in the office it was cool to see him as a lead in a movie uh, he is a such a good actor um, so that was cool to see him in that but um, yeah that's kind of my thoughts on 13 hours um, not great not horrible um, by the end of the year probably gonna be forgettable but um, yeah that's gonna wrap up this vlog hopefully you guys enjoyed it if you did make sure to give it a thumbs up if you haven't subscribed yet hit that red subscribe button www.trekfisher.com for online personal training and apparel thanks again so much for watching guys see you in the next one peace